Apparently you can like, there's, there's a way you can like hang off the side of aggro whilst doing stuff. Yeah, but it requires buttons. Oh, okay. I don't know which buttons. Well, in that case. Then blow me down and whistle Dixie. Oh, that it's button. like R1 and triangle and hold the stick in a direction, I think. No? Okay. I don't know. Oh, there we go. It kind of makes you spin a bit. It's a little awkward. That's cool. So we're not alone. Is that referring to the people that we saw in the cutscene? Or... I think... I don't know. It, we'll see you when we get to the... I hope so. Nice to have some friends we can talk to. I say talk to, make like weird moaning noises out. That seems to be the language. How do we know they'll be friendly? Um, by the body language, probably. And the tone of voice. Uh, it's really awkward when you run out of light. Yeah. Also, if Agro seems yeah. to like them or not. Because he's yeah. quite a... Well, they kill oh, no, Agro, Agro is a she. Agro is definitely a she. I looked yeah, it up. Yeah, but it's a horse, so it doesn't matter. Uh, what? What do you mean? Horses don't really Have genders. care about... They're gender fluid. Shall we jump? Again. This is where we were last time. Oh, not last time, but ages Yo, ago. Oh my god! <laughs> god's sake. I don't know why that works. There is very little fall damage in this game. Which is very much for the best. So, <laughs> why is this river a lake where we're so shallow? It's I don't so know if I'm weird. meant to go here. The textures do look quite rough. Yeah. It's just like a random flat bit of water. It's like they put it in for scenery, but they didn't really expect anyone to actually go there. Mm. Oh well. Fuck you, game. I'm gonna explore your hidden shit. I was just whinnying in the distance. Apparently some of the trees have fruit on them. What are you doing? <laughs> One's just falling over in the swamps. I don't know how you'd get to fruit on a tree. I'm gonna climb trees. Only some of them. Only oh, ones which have fruit on them. That way. Um, Alright, you want to climb? It's just like in Skyrim. Just point your horse <laughs> Where you need to go, and just close your eyes and move. Open them if you hear like a growl. Because you're being attacked by like some kind of bear or some shit, I don't know. Yeah, but the bear won't be able to follow the horse, because horses are better than bears. Why is there just a fuck off desert? I don't know, it's just sudden. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're going to Stonehenge, let's go. Yeah. I love Stonehenge. It's kind of shit. Yeah. It's kind of cool. You like can't go that close to it around. No, it's, it's not as good as it used to be, but at least it's like more preserved, I guess. But, I don't know. I really like to. Oh. Oh, okay, here we go. I didn't think that this. I thought this was going to be a save shrine. Yeah, same. Oh my god! Holy yeah. shit! Yeah. It's a massive this tentacle is, monster. This is the biggest colossus in the game, I'm fairly sure. Is it? My god! Whoa! <laughs> Hello. Is that because it's the longest, or just generally like? Definitely the longest. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know how it works. Because <laughs> you want to just be like, well, shit. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Help us, aggro. So what do we have? We oh have my god. Shoot it in the weird testicle. Oh, thing. it is something. I did, what? That did a lot of damage. Well, these are like its floaty bits. These are the things which are keeping it from not falling. Oh, it's like a blimp. Yeah, it's like a blimp worm. We got to pop his balloons. God, it's like it's like Battlefield One graphical balloons in it, right? I've never played a Battlefield no. game in my life. The, the the new one that's coming out in a bit. I didn't really know that there was a new one. Okay, I think I got all of his air sacks. He's gonna land now. He looks like um, the epic music has started. What's that? Oh, can climb his wings? Yes. No. Oh, I missed. <laughs> no, you can. Did you see the ridges? Yeah, yeah. Um, he looks like that. Oh, God. There's um, the Yu Gi Oh! monster. 
There's a Yugi monster. It's like a, a, a dragon made of bone. And it's, it's not, normal, not so much the rest of his body, but like the front of his head looks quite like that. I'll put a picture. But yeah, it looks a bit like that, dude. Yugi monsters are fucking weird. Some of them are really cool. This is definitely the biggest. Some of them are like, yeah, it's awesome. it's just... <laughs> Look how he's staring. <laughs> he's so rigid. Oh, look at the sand. It's going everywhere. He's causing a lot of sand dunes to be destroyed and created around them. Why is it sandworms that need aggro? Nice. Aggro. <laughs> he fell over. Look at aggro. Okay, now what? Oh! Uh, oh, we glitch. Four. We kind of twist around weirdly and then. Alright, aggro! There he is. <laughs> He's like, why are you shouting? Literally right here, you prick. This is the only class that I know the name of. He's called Phalanx. Oh, phalanx, okay. I knew there was one called Phalanx, just from looking up names. That was one that stuck, but I didn't know anything about him. Oh, oh, no. Where are you going? Get back here. He's going up in the world. <laughs> but it's kind of awkward to jump onto him because you have to keep up speed with yeah. Agro at the same time. Speaking of Agro, where did you go? I mean, I've already fucked this guy right up because now he can't fly. Yeah, he really ruined his day. Mm. He's going to spend a long time, like. If all it takes is an arrow up. in each one, they shouldn't be able to survive in sand. Nah. You think like a small sharp stone or something would come along and ruin everything. Ooh, you Maybe your arrows are magical there. Oh, nearly. Ah. Oh. Oh, no, oh, glitched oh. into that one. <laughs> Can I smack your butt on it? You did. You, you wanted to try to do like a pirouette in the air for science. And he didn't. It was an unsuccessful pirouette. I mean, it was a successful pirouette. It just didn't help us get onto the the big fucker, which is the main goal of what we're doing here. Maybe inside. Is cool. Maybe no, Agro's getting um, sand in his eye, and that's not that's not nice. I don't know if you ever look, had sand go in your shit. eye, but it's look kind of at shit. this. It's fucking cool. It's this quite whale-like. Yeah, he's like a sky whale worm. A bone sky whale worm dragon. Cut him off at the pass. The, the massive sand clouds are so fucking cool. They're really well done. Like, the way they. It's, it's not just like one cloud coming up behind him, it's, it's very inconsistent in, in like its appearance, which is quite realistic. Yeah, I wouldn't get it by that time. Oh! Oh! Yeah, nice. I don't know where to go when you get to the top, that's the only I think you have to try and make like a big jump and get over this ridge area. Let's do the top first before we... Oh, hello. There we go. I didn't happen last time. Oh dear. So to wait for the right moment and then jump across. Oh! It's not across, you bastard. Just walk across, there we go. Alright, sort out. Let's uh, go, motherfucker. I can't get to his front, so I guess we're going back. It's like a nice little shelter here, actually, because it's a bit tense. fin. Oh, here we go. Oh, there's a flap. Yeah. Can you lower it? Lower on top of this. I would say it looks like it can be lowered. I wonder who will close that one if it gets destroyed. No. <laughs> well, he's kind of using that to steer and stuff. Yeah, it's like his rudder. Ooh. Hello, oh my god, oh, oh my god. Fuck, this is cool. <laughs> is he just gonna keep barrel rolling to throw me go, off? Go, 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 go. There's like a sarcophagus on him. That looks a bit like a coffin when he went past. Your mum's a coffin. Oh, I mean, a, co a coughing? My mum's at least a wheezing. Thank you very much. Oh, he's, that was rude. Now what? <laughs> Look at how. Small the desert looks from that bit. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh. Mistakes were made. Oh. Well, I guess he's gone. 
What's going on? Sleep on that. Oh! You nearly got crushed. Hey! <laughs> you alright? You bastard. You should very much just stay underground now. Yeah, these colossus, they can't leave a fight. They're very proud. Maybe that's what it is. They're like the um, the, the Sontarans in, in Doctor Who. They, they physically can't run away from a fight. Is he actually gone? Okay, never mind. His health bar's disappeared. This is what he was referring to with you are not alone. Oh, uh, what? Are there more of them? Oh, there he is. <laughs> if you get close to him, he's just back under again. He's so majestic. Is he filled with his sacks again? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. With sand? <laughs> is that how he's flying? It could be some sort of weird chemical reaction that produces like helium or something. That's true. We don't know how stuff works in this universe. My bow was acting really weird there. I realized you were running into a wall. No, before then. Just kind of slightly gyrating, and gyrating on a horse is, yeah. as we all know, a big no-no. Because -no, they don't like it, or like it too much. Both are possible. It's so weird the way he, like, he can go like above and below the sand. How's that yeah. weird? There are plenty oh, yeah. of lizards and things that are like that. Yeah, but, yeah, but like, he, he, can, he can fly or he can like travel perfectly well beneath the sand. That's quite unique. Which is a good thing. But just, just commenting on it. You should watch the like gifs of lizards going into the sand because it looks really silly and adorable at the same time. Yeah. Alright, first time, first time, first time. Oh, never mind. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah, you got your pump for it, you got your pump, come on! Come on! Smack yourself on the head. Get ready. Oh, okay. I can slap you in the head for you, if that would help. I'll hit you back twice as hard. Okay. That's, that's how people get pumped though, isn't it? In like, in like walker rooms? Changing rooms. They just like slap each other's butts and stuff. I don't know. That wasn't was a changing room you were in. Oh. <laughs> That's what they, they told me it was normal. Oh. Come on, Angry. Try again. This one doesn't seem to be too, like, have too many ways of really attacking you. No, this one's a very peaceful one. He just wants to be left to Yeah, alone. he just doesn't want to be bothered. And we're just here bothering him. Yeah. It's kind of mean, really. You're a bad person. I can't jump. There you go. Oh, hello. That's great. Oh, this is the one we already destroyed. Yeah. It yeah. Well, it wouldn't make sense for his fingers yeah. to have changed, his arms to have changed location. There's nothing here. It's like it looks like there's just like someone's been buried there on top of him. Um, Mind you, just saw that. Ah. When you get onto him, it's quite easy to like stab normally. I didn't do much. I did a fair bit actually. Normally. I normally do. Okay. That's probably. Ah, uh, that's when you get the one in. Is that the entire thing? There we go. Oh. In the battle, battle yeah. I know, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, definitely, yep. Yeah. I don't know if there's much point going for the last one or not. 
So he is just going to dive into the sand when I get to it. Yeah, I might as well see if we can get like one sand burn on it. I don't know how it works, if like, it's a certain amount of time you get on top of him or if it's just when you reach. No, there we go. Maybe if you like stop. Maybe if you like actually really, really quiet, I'll forget you up here. And just say. Uh... Oh my god. You good? See, this is the kind of thing that makes more sense to knock you out. Mm. <laughs> Falling from the skies and landing even in the sand. It also happens when there's nothing that can hurt yeah. you. Yeah. Nice little ring there. Do you reckon we get like, extra points if he goes through it? I'd like to think so. Go on, win the race! Yay! I'd like to thank um, Agro. <laughs> Agro, as, as we just said. Um, I think that's it, to be honest. No one else has really helped us. Some bitch that we're doing this for. Her name's like. I don't know, actually. Layla. Know. Princess Leia. And. There he is. Oh, hey. Although he doesn't serve us anywhere near us, he's gonna bug us off. So maybe if we go over here, they won't see me. Oh, here he comes again. It's kind of difficult to judge arrows when oh, we got it. flying through the air at a weird sand creature. And whilst you're riding a horse at the same time. Oh, wow. That's all. Let's pick that. Yeah, they, they, they definitely seem to let out some kind of like powdery thing, which probably is something to do with the sand. I'm curious to know. I'm, I'm excited to look this one up, to be honest. What do you mean, look it up? Well, because we'll always have to like look up each one afterwards um, to find out the name for the, for the episode. It's called Phalanx. Yeah, yeah, but... Did it. I, I, I need to check the spelling. I want to read about them. Uh, they always have like trivia and stuff about each one on the website, which is really interesting. I read all the trivia about the um, unused ones. No, there was a little gargoyle demon type one which looked really cool, but they didn't include him. When you say little, was he like genuinely? He wasn't that big. He he was one of the smaller ones. He was, he was like. Uh, cat man size ish, apparently. He looked okay. bigger to me. But... Here we go. Stage mm. three, I guess. I have no idea where the stabby point is. It's way down. Is it definitely on his tail? Yeah. There was, well, there was a third flap that closed as we got near it. So I don't want to go all the way down there and then discover it. Oh wait, it's actually Whee! on forehead. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just further down here. So this is the second one. And um, this looks like it would be S here. It's been a while since we fought one that had like multiple points to be honest. The last like few have all just had one point to stab. I felt like having to like maneuver around them to get to different points. Mm. It make it it. You're fighting something enormous. It kind of makes more sense. Yeah, I have to get it in different places. I mean, there's a, a, a small one. Obviously, you can really fit more onto it. Yeah. But it made sense if it only have one. Whereas like the huge we just fought in the lake, like. Yeah. It, can, it was kind of a, I, I kind of liked him to have one on his head here to get, and then you to go underneath him to get the other one. That would have been cool. Or like. A minor one on his head, you have to stab yeah. to make the things activate. Yeah. I feel really bad about killing this one. Yeah, that one was, was very peaceful. Look <laughs> at Do you see Acro? Look at him. He's like frozen down at Oh my god. He's yeah. <laughs> pretending to be the horse in Santander there, out of it. Just like frozen in place forever. Oh, he's still here. <laughs> he's still on top of him. Try and get hit by them in the air. I killed this. Oh, come on. Shadows. Oh, okay. 
Oh my god. <laughs> Bye. We drowned in fair. Is that how that bitch sings? If that was her speaking and that was her singing voice, then I don't think we should bother. At the very least, she should never enter like X Factor or anything. She doesn't was have that singing or was that calling out? Might be calling out. Either way. She's kind of a nasally voice. Not nasally. She's kind of an annoying voice. I don't think she should sing. That's my point. Great time. They're not even really distinguishable as people after them, you know, they're just like a mass of shadows. Standing around us disapprovingly. Was that number 13? Um, yes. Yes. We've only got three left then. This is true. And then the next one is Bastard Cat Brother, so. Brother with a bastard cat. The Guardian set this close up city beyond the channel. Okay. Is he going to be like really aggressive? Did Dormin normally sound like that? He went more high pitched then. Well, he always has like a number of different voices mm. that are all speaking at the same time. Maybe one of them I've just... never heard it that like that before, though. There's definitely been a higher pitched one mixed in there. I don't think it's ever been that prominent before. Well, I'm wondering if he's going to possess her if she comes back to life, but is actually him. Oh my god, that'd be hot. I mean, awful. Because we we still don't know if we don't we don't know anything. We just yeah. know that we've been told to kill these things. So that and, we can then he, and then he and then he promises something about returning her to life. 